<laughs> yeah, eat lads. Good morning, guys. It's, it's another early start. Well, it's not that early. It's eight o'clock, but you know, for, for us, for us YouTube leisure men, it's not. No, I'm joking. We're going to we're going to Richard this morning for Blackpool Performance because we are prepping the Subaru for a track day. Yes, we're going on a track day, and Jesse. Jesse with the course is coming along with us. He's gonna be the cameraman and he's gonna, well, he's got a day off, so he wants to join and he's gonna be the cameraman. Now, Jesse lives on a posh street, so we're probably waking up all the neighborhood cats which like to eat lasagna. Hopefully, let's, hopefully I don't have to text him saying I'm here, because normally I don't. Normally everyone says, I know, I can hear your fucking earth rumbling. And of course, I have told you about this track day before. We're going to a track day on the 3rd of September at Rockingham. We're going down with Funk Motorsport. It's an open track day, so, you know, it's basically just on and off track all day as much as you want. I'm not going to be going too hard, but, yeah, if you do want to come down, uh, I'll post a little poster now on the screen of how you can get tickets and stuff. So, you, if you do do track day, and come down, do a track day with me, come out in my car, I'll get in your cars, have a laugh, basically. And you can do passenger laps as well, so if you do live near Rockingham and you want to just come and watch them and have a passenger lap, so, etc., you can pay for that as well. He is. He's got some sort of superhero bag on. Why is my camera not focused? What the fuck is that, lad? What is that? Hang on, I can't see it. Do you not like my bag? Is that how you get all the birds nowadays, lad? My keys. That and a Corsa. <laughs> so we got some fuel to please Stella, sandwich to please me, a monster to please my energy, and some fruit to please the government. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> What? what? Oh my god, he did. Oh, I, I'm, I am speechless, mate. Come Hello. I'm sorry, but I'm robbing that wing. Right, what do we need? Uh, right, I need a, a hex 6 mil, please. We'll just swap boot lids. Right, so funny story with the brake diff, right? <laughs> I messaged Richard and I said, uh, I said, hey, mate, like, I just want some decent brake diff. Uh, and he sent me to someone, so I rang him up, got a quote, and said, yeah, we'll send you the quote through through email. <laughs> Bear in mind, when you say decent, it's like, you know, good, but cheap. <laughs> I, think decent, I think Richard misunderstood the word decent, so I rang these people, and they gave me a quote through, and it said something like 920 quid for two bread. I was like, I thought it was a, I thought it was a typo at first. <laughs> I was like, how much? <laughs> For two brakes? This <laughs> I don't know. I didn't even. Look. I see the numbers, mate, and I was like, I, was, I mentioned back. I was like, I'm sorry, but that's a bit out of my price range for two brakes. This, yeah. So thanks, Rich, just putting me through that embarrassment. What the hell, mate? What's wrong if I had that much money? If I had that much money, I wouldn't have a WRX. No. <laughs> what roll, roll bars? Just trying to get you something for free. <laughs> oh, God, well, we love free stuff, don't we? <laughs> Keep talking, Richard. Keep talking. Keep talking. I'll leave you to it. Get some free shit. We get treated with the ramp today. This is amazing for me. My shoulders have took years of hammering on that bloody <laughs> bricked pavement in my house. So this is Richard's inner teacher coming out. Because <laughs> he is a Yoda, isn't he? He's the teacher. He's the teacher of the Scoobs. What have you thought, Alex? Check tyres and wheels, any damage, any just tyre pressures. Check steering, plenty of payment, check suspension coming leaks, uh, check brake pads, well, yeah, they're fucked anyway, so we don't need to check them. Check engine, for example, current leaks, we have got a bit of a coolant leak, we'll just ignore that. Check all, yeah, check under the bonnet for levels, check batteries to make sure you can check lights and wipers work really. Oh, mate, the wipers are absolutely ruined. <laughs> like, I actually can't see anything. Talk wheel knots, yeah, visual cancer. Bloody hell. Oh, on the day. Oh, Richard, what is this? Thing to take with you. Oh, this is lovely. A bulb kit. What do we need bulbs for? Yeah, I have to bring my bulb out. What will, will, what, will they not let you on track now? Well, you should take one if it goes. Oh, right, okay. Roll a gaffer tape, cable, cable ties. Do you need to let me know on that, Richard? I've got the most important thing, camera at the pet, camera and petrol. Oh, and, the, and last but not least, don't sell stuff. <laughs> I'm not selling her. Right, hang on. We're going to get the tools ready. I'm going to see how fast we can do it. I need a little hammer. Perfect. And I need a punch. Yeah, it's quite enough, wasn't it? Right. <sighs> Are we ready? Go. Why are the pistons in? No, I did that the right tool! <laughs> you push it back at the same time, otherwise. When you push the bottom one, the top one pops out. Isn't that right, Richard? It is. Oh, I love having a copper grease on my hands. 
Oh my god, that was a great take. <laughs> <laughs> Zero effort. Okay, I thought I'd be a little bit quicker than this. Ah, didn't find the razor fever then, no. I thought I'd do it, though. <laughs> It's all that, it's all that fast driving, they've just come undone on their own, do you know what I mean? It's <laughs> this clean, is it? Ready to go off? Oh, that's a rear, aren't it? No, it's not. Look how beautiful they are. Pardon? Start. What? Clean the face up. Oh, sorry, I forgot to do that, Rich. <laughs> We've got our black diamond pads, which... Uh, a, a nice guy off Instagram recommended, so thanks to you. I can't remember your name, but I think you'll definitely know. And these have got the best rating on out of all of them on Scoob World. Richard didn't recommend these, did you, Richard? No. But the ones that Richard recommended, I'd have to be pretty much a millionaire to afford. Yeah, so. You know, for the for, for the break, for the pads and discs, I could have got a 172 clear one and just track that. But yeah, are we putting are we putting these noise reducers in or whatever they are? Yeah. Stick it on the back here, not the front. Yeah, they'll be a bit useless then, won't they? Quality of that. Black diamond if you're watching. I'm looking for a sponsor. <laughs> So we're going to clean the sliding bits. <laughs> YouTube comments. Have you got a little bit of a brush just to... Oh. Use finger, mate. Oh, mate, I've got a buttering lighter. Right, I think I need any really small cable tie, Richard. Please put it on. Perfect. And stop the cut. Right, we did that in... We did that in 3 minutes 16, Richard. No, you didn't. 3 minutes 16. Wow! Well, no, 3 didn't. minutes 16, that's amazing. No, no, no. Come on, you bastard. Yeah. Look at this guy. Oh. Seen better days, hasn't he? Better Richard's like fucking YouTubers. <laughs> have to explain things three times. <laughs> Take that out of there. Come on, you bastard. Holy shit. Yeah, anyway, go on. Carry on. <laughs> <laughs> what do we do after that? There's an adjuster in the back of that. Right, so you need to wind the handbrake adjuster off. With what? Is it a ball or? Right. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> this is something, a wheel, a wheel wouldn't be the way I'd describe it. What would you describe that as? <laughs> little, little, metal, little metal wanker. So basically that's the adjuster. So you need to put that in there, yeah. and then wind that up. So that releases the adjuster on your shoes. But what normally happens, if you don't undo that, you'll break some shit. That lip on the disc yeah. pulls the end of the shoes off. Then you smash the uh, handbrake shoes. And it's a good job we didn't do it on the drive then, isn't it? It's a good job we fair down today. <laughs> These discs are going in the bin, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so the disc was like rattled on and you couldn't get it off. Yeah. Two bolts in there. Yeah. Well, Richard, you're a clever man. Bottom on. So he's a magician, isn't he? If I get back early enough, I'll be able to. Yeah. Not right now, a bit, a bit tighter. Just do, just do half a tip. Two minutes, 12 seconds. <laughs> what, two seconds? Two seconds? I thought I took. Yeah, yeah. It took two seconds? Yeah, yeah. So the brakes are pretty much done. They look beautiful. They've got well good with the wheels on. What's next? Let's, 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 let's get back to the butt cut. We'll some, have we'll some dirty fingerprints on it just to make it authentic. Did you say we've got a, a anti-roll bar? Yeah, I think our friends at Super Pro have donated one. Our friends at Super Pro have donated one? Have they actually? Yeah. Fuck me, Matt. What front? Or, what front or rear one? Rear. Oh. Oh. What colour is it? Blue. Close to purple. We'll have it. I can actually like flex that with me. Oh, legends! Absolute legends. I've got a little bit. I've got a bit of dirt in the grill. What's, what's up with you? Just got a little bit. Of, it'll be alright. Fuck it. <laughs> oh. Wow. Get the plug, get the plug, get the plug. It's not focusing. Focus the plug, mate. Well, these are new mounts. Better push these, yeah? Oh, we got a sticker as well. We'll bang that on the back. I'm going to create the back window as like stickers of, you know, yeah, like a, like a wall of people who've helped me. So yours at the top. Try and clean it. Yeah, they're a bit, bit rusty now. 
Hold on, the light's not very good here because it's. Is it not? Mm, that might be all right actually there. these bolts. <sighs> Roll bars on looking good. It's gonna feel like a like a car again maybe. Right then what's next? Exhaust. Is it it does rattle quite a lot to be fair. Especially on the idle. When I'm like next to like a wall or something and Mackie's drive through it's horrendous. Yeah, it sounds exactly like that, but wire. the wire rattling. Does it, does it even need to be there, that wire? I'm just thinking that. It's not doing anything, is it? It's actually like, it's doing nothing, is it? No, we're not doing Right, especially this one, like, look at that. Mr. Richard just said... No, I didn't. Yeah, he did. He said, as much as he takes the piss out of it, it is quite strong. But these are what's making the rattling. So I'm just going to cut them off, because they're doing absolutely nothing. And he wants um, just over three for it. Keep Oh, oh. What was that, Richard? It's not that rusty, is it? No. Oh. It could be cleaner, but we're look into that silver one. Though. Well, yeah, but I'll, uh, how long have you spent on this one? Enough. Enough to... <laughs> no, it is gorgeous, though. So. Were you saying this is what you do a lot of the time now, just under ceiling and stuff? Yeah, restoration. It is gorgeous, though. It's all paint. Is that sprayed or br brushed? No, or brushed. Brushed? Oh. <laughs> It is nice though. I mean, if I had that car, I'd just, I don't know, I, I, it's like, you can never see it, can you really? No, but I only got this because I looked in the previous MOTs and it didn't have one rust issue ever, so I thought, get it. Even if it has like some, like, little problems can be fixed, but once you've got rust, that's it then, isn't it? Yeah. So, she was a good girl. She was a good girl. Yeah, so people didn't know, Richard actually used to own this car. How long? About a year ago? A bit longer? A year before. Yeah, so this is actually Richard's. That's how, that's how we become friends, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she is bone dry. She's always good. That's okay, that mate. She's alright, ain't she? Give her a wrap and see if you need to be careful, have you? Right. Look at her face. Richard says get him ruled professional and my bank account disagreed. <laughs> <laughs> Pull it down a little bit, it's kind of getting much fucking thing there. Oh, I brought my underglow kit as well. What do you want? My underglow kit. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm gonna do that in my own time. <laughs> right, wheels are back on. Let's go over what we've done. Brakes all the way around. Sorted the exhaust out that was hanging. Sorted some like the bumper that was loose, side skirts that were loose. Uh, Anti roll bar at the back, shout out to Super Pro Legends. We're still in the top of the brake fluid. Oh, I've rolled this arch back because it's been hit catching that tyre, so I've rolled that out because if I'm going into a corner or something, that's going to grab that tyre. So I've done that. Everything. I think we still need to start the other side skirt because that is going to fly off and it does keep falling off. So we need to start out that side skirt on that side. Then we're done, I think. We went for a different yeah. sticker because the other one was meant to go on the roll bar, so it, it didn't come away from the back end, but now we're repping. Right. Ooh. Bit hungry, me lad, are you? I'm a bit hungry. A bit hungry, lad, a bit hungry. Yeah. Funk Motorsport. Like, like, get, in like get in touch with him, he absolutely loves that, that, that turbo blanket. He's well impressed. So is So is it? But yeah, well, send, get in touch. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, you've not got the turbo. No. <laughs> See, when I was talking about a video the other day when I said the engine management light on and it shouldn't be on, this is why it shouldn't be on because it's saying no codes present and it does it all the time but it keeps throwing an engine management light up someone on the forums did actually say something about it's the lambda sensor or something like that but it's very 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 annoying <laughs> i'd be lost without you richard thank you love you, love you. <laughs> he's a guy isn't he? absolute legend the car's pretty much ready i'm actually impressed with like how good it is underneath like it's really good Richard was saying that like there's, there's no even rust spots even starting obviously you know when you look at it from a, from a distance it actually looks like rusty but it's just literally just dirt and shit but no it's uh I'm very pleased I'm very pleased with this
strip her out, sort a few bits of side skirts and shit. But oh, it's gonna be a fun day. Brakes feel good actually, they feel really good. But like I can't explain like how cool is Richard? He's a top guy. He's the coolest guy. guy ever. Like like he, I remember he sent me that uh, little checklist last night at like well he sent me a preview of it last night at like half eleven so he said he's spending his night doing a little checklist for me and oh, I love him so much, he's such a guy. He's literally one of the only reasons, a massive reason why like, I don't want to get rid of the Subaru because he's just fucking ace, he's just absolutely ace. Don't forget your, your superhero bag lad. Oh hold on. <laughs> Right, He's leaving the time. whiny G's. Thank Enjoy you for filming, it. lads. No worries. Have a good night. Have a good night. See you before. Have a good time on track. Uh, I'm sure you will. So you just wear that, yeah, innit? So. All right. See you a bit, lads. Right, see you. What? Oh, your that keys, was mate. That was close. Don't forget them to the to the whip. To the chav. To the chav, my bill. I'll catch my you, mate. See you a bit, lads. Have a good one. See you, right. boys.